Hey all, welcome back. Today we'll be checking out episode 5 of Why Rayliana Ended Up at the Duke's Mansion. Why Rayliana Was Taken Away. So, as we remember from the last episode, she was taken away when everyone was distracted. My guess is on her douchebag of a former fiancé, because he seemed like he had a screw loose when we first were introduced to him. Hopefully this will be a more action-packed episode, so let's not waste any more time and jump right in. More 3D horses. And there's our Rayliana, all passed out. Knocked unconscious. Yep, it's him. That's the douchebag, right? Oh no. Oh no, I have I have wrong subtitles. Magpie was watching. <laughs> Everything's in Spanish. <laughs> So you were a prostitute, or a pimp. That name's familiar. Why? What? Is this some sort of, like, stupid religious bullshit? I can't get money from a dead girl. Dude, your sister just died. Why are you like so fucking smug about yourself right now? So he's being coerced into doing this. So arguably, technically, he didn't do it the first time. But he all but did it, you know? He emotionally manipulated someone into doing it. So that's just as bad, if not completely worse. There's no going back now. In for a penny, in for a pound. Fucking... Oh. oh no, not the red eyes. Why did they zoom in from the corner? Why didn't they like zoom in from like... Or zoom out from the center of her face? Pretty fucking dizzy. Chloroform does that to a person. But I kill you. Or try to. Where's a gun? Do you got a gun? I'm really good with a gun. Not really. No, that's just the fact. Not my face. I'm trying to play it off as like a chibi moment like they did in the original. But because it's not like just pictures, we have like a tone set with music. You know, we, we know how scary the situation is. We can't just play it off as we I'm sorry. Like, fuck you, Jake. Yeah, didn't your sister die? Like, what's your whole deal, Spiel? By kidnapping someone else. Yeah, I don't understand your motivation at all. <laughs> yeah, this guy's gone off the deep end. Kinda. Then why are you doing this? What's your motivation? You just want money? And it's not like this is either of those. Of course. Conveniently. Now they can catch up to us. Yeah, you go, girl. Except you're in heels, so a jump like that should not land that easily. You're in heels in the swamp. How did you get away from me? Too bad you don't have a real badass husband and a guard knight that's twice as badass. 
still in heels. Now you look like some sort of Princess of Soliana or some bullshit. No, her hair has been put down. That was, this is like, there was no pressure to it. There was no, like, it was just in front of her hand. There was no pulling back or anything. Or, like, sure, we might find out in a second that it's actually, like, Adam or someone. Yeah. You know, so he wasn't being harsh with her. But still, you know, like, you want someone to shut up, you put your fucking hand on their mouth. It's not his name. That's, his name is Adam. I don't. Have you ever referred to him as Taylor yet? Like, what? <laughs> that was awkward. You know, like there was no, there was no lead up to his attack. It was just ching, swords away. Hey, look, he's there, and we already did the thing, and yeah, we didn't ask, bro. Yeah, where did all that come from? So now that your sister's dead, you decided to kidnap another girl with the man who killed your sister. Please do. Adam, just do it now. Dude, don't fucking live your life by what some douchebag is trying to... Plot twist you into doing. Pocket sand! Okay, what was that? Poison? Acid? Pheromones? Is that a giant turtle? Like, why are you framing it so awkwardly? Like, sure, you want to do a big fancy reveal or something, but still. I haven't even, in both of its like, little appearances, gotten any idea of what the heck I'm expecting. A monkfish. Okay. Ew. The framing is so awkward. And why are you now at a precarious cliff? There is no... There's no consistency with where they're standing. Like, I have no idea where they're moving or anything since... There's no establishing shots, you know? There's no way I can get my bearings in this forest. I don't think Adam's thinking like that. I think he's just thinking, you're in the way, I need to kill this thing right now. But at the same time, you're tumbling off a cliff. Or... Nothing like a life or death situation to make your feelings come out. Nah, he's slaying that monster like Nelson's business. Because he knows how awesome Adam is! Ew! And I still don't know how big a monkfish is. All we've seen is its face so far. How long is it? Is it a fucking round as like a fat toad or is it long as a snake? Like shit, I don't know. Can we eat it? I don't think so, unless we're Gorons. No! Who would have fucking decapitated? So we got this guy, but not the fiance fucker. Yay! And they play that off as a joke? What? <laughs> Ainsley's just like, the fuck is going on? Do not get on Rayliana's bad side. That is a sick, twisted smile. And I'm both afraid and overjoyed. You've just been a good little boy and accept their divorce. 
すべてが円滑にいっていたのに。Like, I get that was supposed to be a kind of like a funny joke in that the setup felt so weird. And I also almost killed them by firing five shots at him. Yay! Feels so much better. Yeah, everyone else is like, are you fucking insane? <laughs> like, excuse me? Ugh. Why do you hate Noah the most? If it wasn't for his love struck ass, you'd probably still be kidnapped right now. That is a pretty landscape. Because you got the feelies now. I don't know if this is true or not, but I hear if you get chloroformed, you don't actually sleep properly, so it's quite believable for her to still be tired after being unconscious for that short amount of time. Because you two have the feelies. Adam, so when you say get rid of them, do you mean decapitate them without a proper trial? Or throw them off a long pier? Like, what are we talking That was definitely an episode. It was more action-packed than I was expecting. But at the same time, the action that was there was shot and framed so shoddily that... I don't know. I'm happy what we got, but I'm also kind of disappointed. It was a fun episode at least, though. I got a good laugh. Wakey wakey, eggs and bakey. No touch. Only sleep. Why are you shirtless? Why Rayliana cosplayed? Okay. Like, you could say why Rayliana dressed up, but specifically cosplaying, you know, sets a certain expectation in my mind. And I don't remember the original story enough to remember any cosplay. So, next week will be an interesting surprise, I suppose. But yeah. That was episode 5. It was the thing. I had some fun. I also had a lot of confusion, but that just seems to be how it goes. Anyway, I'll catch you on the next one. Take care for now. Buh bye bye